Oktoberfest. It's called, uh, aptly named, the Fest Hall. Why? Well, this is where it's all happening. Right behind me, it's very festive. There's a lot of drinking, dancing, drinking, eating, dancing, and, uh, well, the smell of German food is uh, pretty strong right now. So, uh, and you know, obviously Oktoberfest, it's a transplant from Germany more than 200 years ago, but don't tell those guys that. Uh, they think it started last week, and uh, I think it goes on for another week, at least in their minds. So, without further ado, we're going to dance our way in there with uh, maybe some Lederhosen, talk to some people, see why they made the trip here, up here, down here, all from the state of Georgia and beyond. First of all, give me your names. I'm Denver. And this is Michelle. Michelle. Denver, where are you from? I'm from uh, Cobb County, just right above Atlanta. And? I'm from the same place, Ackworth, Georgia. And uh, I didn't get your name, I apologize. Jake. Jake, and uh, how do you know these guys? Uh, we've been friends for years. Oh. Years, high school. High school, high school, yeah. Sure. Well, good. Did, uh, <laughs> meet, meet that friend for a long time. Um, all right, let's talk about why did you come to Oktoberfest? I've been coming now for, this is my fourth year coming. Yeah. I love coming here. It's a great place. Um, beautiful change of weather. Um, lovely beers, beautiful women. It's always a good time. Well, good deal. And is this a nice little vacay? It is, yeah. it is. Yeah. It, it, it's a nice uh, quick vacation away from home. Um, you know, you can get away. It's not too far away from the uh, city. And, uh, you know, it's good times. And you? Yeah, it's, it's only a two hour drive. We're up here on a Friday. We come home on a Sunday. It's, it's fun. Excellent time. Yes. Good deal. I have two more questions. One, our show is called Georgia on a Budget. Excellent. So, is this kind of a, a, an affordable getaway? We rented a lodge, six of us. It costs us about 50 bucks each. So, and then your beer is reasonably priced. I mean, you can get two liters <laughs> in a booth. And, and the rest is history. It's not that expensive at all. <laughs> so what it's all a boot, as the Canadians would say in German way. It's all a boot. It's all a boot. All right, uh, well, can we just kind of rock our way out of here and we'll sing Georgia on a budget. <laughs> It is very festive here, and so, of course, I got the festive shirt, but I thought I was festive until I saw this right here. That is some festiveness right there. Who do we have here? Hey, what's up? I'm Trey. Trey, and tell everybody your last name. Van Dyke. Van Dyke, and it could be, what's the sound of music? The Van... Van Trops. Van Trops. Van Trops, because yes. you're the... Can you sing The Hills Are Alive? I could, um, but not right now. Okay, that's fine. And who's your lovely lady who's not dressed in? This is Danielle. Uh, Danielle. And Danielle, how are you? I'm good. How are you? Danielle, yeah, just kind of open up a little bit, Danielle. There you go, so we can see you. And Danielle, real quick, you look very cute and nice tonight. Thank you. How do you what are you thinking right here? I think he's hot. <laughs> uh, he it, well, it is hot. And let's talk about the, the get-up. Explain what we're wearing tonight. Okay, originally I came with something that my mom made out of like just just like pieces of fabric. It was horrible. But then I went to one of these great shops here in Helen and I actually found this for a reasonable price. And I was like, okay, I'm definitely going to buy this. Yeah. And I've been going to Oktoberfest for several years and I got this for pretty affordable. I was like, this is awesome. Yeah. I'm definitely living the German dream right now. The German dream. And of course our show is called George on a Budget okay. and he even got his outfit on a budget. And real quick, let's talk about your connection to this band. You were very excited. Okay, yeah. And tell everybody who the band is and your connection. Okay, Sauerkraut. It's a long story here. When I was a young kid, I mean, I grew up in Houston. Uh, I'm in Georgia because uh, I'm in the military. But when I grew up in Houston, we always went to uh, San Antonio to Fiesta, Texas. Yeah. And there was a German hall there. Yeah. And the Sauerkraut's always played. And when I was like five, I did the, the chicken dance and everything. Really crazy. And I used to get rowdy when I was like five, man. It was crazy. But uh, later, I went to an Oktoberfest in Texas, and the sauerkrauts were playing there, and I couldn't believe it. And then I come here. I'm in Georgia. I'm like, okay, definitely yep. going to the Oktoberfest. And I see the sauerkrauts are headlining here, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to go actually talk to him and see if he remembers me. You are like a deadhead, but except with polka. I'm totally a German groupie. You are a German kind of deadhead polka guy. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for talking with us and enjoy the night. And I will ask real quick, how many times have you been to this Oktoberfest? This is my first time, and I'm loving it. It's amazing. <laughs> there you go. Do I need to say, why am I even here?
I've had a great time today. Helen was amazing, and the scenery was amazing, and the prices can't be beat. From breakfast at Hofer's to partying at the Fest Hall, we only spent about 26 bucks the whole day. And, of course, you might want to add in lunch for another $10 or so. All told, however, we still managed to beat our benchmark of going to the movies. And one last money-saving tip. If you come out to the Fest Hall on Sunday, admission is free. Also, Sunday and weekday nights are much cheaper if you're staying in a hotel, including the Hellendorf. It'll also give you the opportunity to beat the crowds. And that about sums up our tour of Helen. We hope you had a great time and learned something along the way. Now it's time to get busy. I have got my shirt, my puffy shirt. Dad, so, would you like to dance? I would love to dance, and i tell you everybody else. In the meantime, you guys are lovely, by the way. It's the perks of the job. And uh, well, remember, ladies, uh, George on a budget. All of you guys travel on the cheap. I'm gonna go dance with two lovely ladies. Let's go. Let's go. All right, which way? Woo! And of course, the best part after working hard all day at Oktoberfest is a little beer. <laughs> Especially the ones that own restaurants. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Sounds good. You sound like my kind of girl. She's like a yoga person. See, what's German? Do they do yoga in German? I don't know. Uh, well, they should. I'm sure they do. Mm -hmm. 